down here now you know what we're looking for something sad and sulking licking lingering wounds <laughs> if it's here he's totally gonna feed us to something awful down here i know it should we expect to fight probably you guys are very good at the whole de-escalation thing doesn't matter what's down here if it can bring us back our grumpy katathian i'm all in and the rest of you should be too come on guys we're the freaking guardians of the galaxy um, is that supposed to be me? I heard you make that speech so many times, and then Gamora says something like, We're going to need Drax? Uh-huh, and then little Fuzzy says, Nope, I ain't playing this game. We're here. Home of the healing light. Source of the cure. Origin of Raker's power. It's a cocoon? Told you she was gonna feed us to some giant bug. Or maybe... She's the bug, and that's some kind of external digestion sack or something. Oh, gross. Please tell me Drax is the only one who's got to go in that creepy egg sack. So the shepherds found fresh flock. Followers. Think fast, beard butt. How the? You know not the gravity of your treacherous trespass. Not quell a god. <laughs> Prepare for oblivion, interloper. Oh, what's this one? Okay, Green Meanie, you're up. <sighs> Found you. Nasty uglies from that busted noggin of yours. It's okay, guys, it's him! Aaron Witchcraft! No, wait, Aiden Warsock! Ashley Warsock? Adam Warlock? That's it! The Golden God guy! Hold on. This guy's Raker's old divine whatever? Looks pretty good for a dead guy. Were you not sent by the sanctimonious shepherd? Us? With Raker? Not a chance. We're trying to shut his ass down. See? Friends. Okay, big guy. In we go. Come on! All the ones where we die already happened. Ugh. Raker's got half the galaxy going cuckoo bananas, her friend included. I swapped your ass for a newer, younger, blue-skinned model. So, can you help us? Mantis seems to think you can cure Drax. My heavenly healing is veiled malignance. A first folly I swore never to repeat. Ugh, can someone translate this guy? He said no. What protection I can proffer is to remain reclusive. Not this time, Goldie. The pieces need to go back together. We just gotta get you all closer to the puzzle. And that would be... In here, of course. Whoa, wait, let, let's talk about... What the butt? It's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. 
Welcome to the Astral Plane, Snorlord. You teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your minds. Merged our what? I gave no consent to this, Planescaper. She's not big on asking permission. It's all pretty sure this and fate of the galaxy that. Don't you get huffy, god guy. Your gold hands are all over this mess. What's that supposed to mean? I thought this guy was how we cure Drax. Cure and cause can coalesce. Uh, guys? Is that Drax? Hi, Groot. So we're going into Drax's head. Literally. Green Meanie's in there somewhere. Find him and convince him to come back to reality. Mantis, please tell me we're supposed to be going into the bright light. Pretty sure. You need to reach the heart of Drax's promise. Much deeper than I've ever seen. Wait, if you've never seen it, does that mean it never happens? Hope not. Just keep going. And if we lose contact, listen to Amy Winsaw. She means you. Quite clearly. This is Drax's promise? Mine was a lot less... downery. This is just the doorstep. Poor guy was stuck here, reliving the loss of his family. Your friend's fear and pain primed him as prey. What do you know about it, Goldilocks? More than I mind. There's the big galoot. That was easy. This is just an echo, little fuzzy. Part of poor Greenie can never stop digging. Uh, until he accepts what's there. You're not the only one that hears that, right? Oh, no. That? Thanks. We got a runner! After him, Starlight! I don't know this part! Tracks! Please be something soft down there! <laughs> Drax? Not Drax. Thanos. Bet you weren't expecting a family reunion, eh, Gamora? I'm going to enjoy this. Hope the rest of you are as ready for this as I am! Light him up, Rocket! after all. Something's not right. You fail to fathom the rules of this realm. <laughs> what the? Okay, that's new. That's new, right? I think I remember there being two of them. Twice the ugly, twice the target practice. <laughs> hey, Goldie! Don't suppose you want to lend a hand! You fight a phantom. We are given form. It is a futile form. At this rate, we're gonna be outnumbered. It's like he can't be killed. As far as Drax is concerned, he probably can't. You're giving in to four greedy obsessions. Only by letting go can you move on. Man, come on, let's I blow something up here, butt jack and more nonsense. Get 
It'll be a slime! It is a destined defeat. Is that supposed to mean something to us? Get off me! You stunt knocking flark bags! Hey, tight! I got you, buddy! Peter! Rocket's down! Rocket! Hang in there! Careful! Useless! <laughs> Peter! Focus! Groot's down! Up you get, little buddy! Not gonna Guys. chop you down that Ahead. easy! Looks like even she's got her limits! That was too close. Ha! Wallberry needed help. This has got my name on it. Look out! I got all these toys. I'm just dying for you. Fortune favors Bailey. I think we did something, but I don't see Drax. Mantis? Your soothsayer holds no sway here. <laughs> Hold up! Look! I bet I could beat you to the center. <laughs> Not so fast, little one. Drax! Wait up! <laughs> Again, Drax, buddy, wait up! Forced to follow fools. <laughs> Damn it! I can hear you. You play pawns on a board built by your opponent. You got a better idea? I'm all ears. Oh, assuming we ever catch him, what then? I'm working on that. Left, little one. Huh? You can see me. Your friend me? is too far fallen to be willed back by words. For someone who's been there. Look! Hey, how did you beat me? <laughs> because I am your father. You've been playing in your mother's garden again. I was hunting. Hunting dirt? No, I chased it, but it was too quick. Only fools rush forward. A hunter waits, chooses her moment. Drax. <clears throat> Papa? Are you alright? Drax, come here, ya. it is time to come home. What the fuck is that? Best little one. Mother waits. Insidious succubus! Release your thrall! Not in Kansas anymore. The flark are those spawn of shadow. Snuff their source while I widen our They're way. They're coming from those nests. One down. The lift relents. Raise the remnants that I might prize our passage. Well, you get all those nests. Relents, you wretch. Intrusion. Peter, maybe hurry up. That's two. These must be connected to what walked our path. So 
Something's I have purchase! Prepare to be pulled within! Hold on to your tails! Don't you dare! I ain't cleaning wood chips out of my car! You want all right? Define all right. I think we gotta look at whatever's keeping us from Drax. You saw simply its spawn. That black stuff. I saw something like it in my promise. Is that? Drax's wife. I think so. Hovat. Then this must be Drax's home. <laughs> you two certainly took your time. Only fools rush. Come, my love. Let us go inside. Drax, buddy. Your words are wasted, wind. Easy, all right. I got this. Come on, big guy. I know you can hear me. Why do you haunt me? We're gonna lose him again. It's me, buddy. Stormlord, remember? We're all here. You're stronger than this, Drax. Come on, you big lug. Don't leave me alone with Quill. Drax, dinner is ready. That's not Hovat. You gotta let her go. You do not know if you ask. Damn it! Here we go again. Seek and destroy, just like last time. Make haste. The maw means to snap shut. I cannot contain it. Charade. Cover your eye holes. It's not good. Clark and nowhere is where we are. Maybe it's not all bad. I don't see any new promise, at least. We are an empty eternal echo. Naked nothingness. Not helping. Oh, wizard. All right, everyone just split up and look for a way out. Or forward, or... Whatever. I lose a bet if I die in a dark pit. It was alone in a dark pit. Drax! Come on, buddy. I know you can hear me. This ain't flarkin' funny. I know you're in a dark place right now. There, look. I can't believe that worked. Let's go. Part of him is still with us, I'm sure of it. I hope you've got one hell of a speech plan, Peter. That makes two of us. Why are you doing this? Do not leave me be. You gotta trust us, Drax. We're trying to help. By destroying my home. Your blissful ignorance is in ignoble pursuit. Easy, Shakespeare. We got this. Come on. You don't really want to stay in this dark hole? I would endure the depths of Sarduth to be with my family. Drax, love. It is time to eat. Look, I get it, man. They seem really special. They are 
are the only thing that matters. My Hovat was the most fearless mate I've ever known. She brought me peace even during times of war. My Camaria. My innocent little Camaria. She was the best of us both. Despite her meager stature, they both were... were... My family is gone. What sits before me? I don't know. But it's not real. It ain't good. It is a perversion. Fed by desperation. Without it... I will have nothing. I cannot be alone again. You're not alone, man. We're here for you. We've all lost someone, Drax. But it gets easier if you surround yourself with... the right people. I am Groot. Uh, Groot said some mushy stuff. Let's just pretend I said it too. We're a team. Papa? Are you okay? Join us, Drax. It's not her. Are you hurt, Papa? Talk to us, love. I will cherish the time that we had. And not resent the time that we lost. And honor you both. Always. How you doing, big guy? You okay? I am of sound mind, thanks to you all. I owe amends for my lapse in judgment. Hey, you don't owe us squat. Ain't none of us perfect. It's kind of our thing. <laughs> How much do you remember? Great darkness grew with every lie that I swallowed. The longer I remained with my family, the more certain I became that I could never leave. Peter Quill. Your child is in danger. If her pain is half my own, the darkness may consume her entirely. Not if I can help it. We gotta be smart about this. There's a whole lot of converted between us and her. A whole lot of that black blorf, too. And anyone wanna tell me why Harry Hobo was able to suck it up? More than why that thing looked like him. Because it is me.
time to go. Hey, Goldie Braun! Wanna get back here and explain that bombshell? Time is tight and your understanding unimportant. Can I shoot him? Come on, let me shoot him. Look, I don't know what's going on, but it's clear this is at least a little bit your fault. Imagine ambivalent omnipotence drifting in darkness. Uh, speaking of dark. Such was my celestial solitude. Power without purpose, until uncovered by Raker. His crew were convalescent. Plagued by a pox, I was serendipitously suited to soothe. A ship full of sick people just happens upon someone with limitless healing? We were need and needed. Symptom and solace. They worshipped the wonder of my ways and declared me divine. I think we know where this is going. I do not know where this is going. This is the scary part? As the flock of followers fawned, a dark delight developed deep within me. And in the shadows it spoke. Weak whelps, pernicious priesting, feeble fools, fit for feasting. Hubris made hunger. A cancerous craving called Magus. What did it want? Complete devotion. I too heard this voice and could hear nothing else. Adulation. Flagellation, gorge with grief and consternation. I told you this was the scary part. It was pure putrefaction, sown from the seed of my strength. My soul stone gone sour. I resolved to rip it out. Rip it out? How? A mechanical marvel wrought by Raker would sever the stone from my skull and excise the evil entangled within. Translation, you let Raker steal your powers. Whatever his wayward wander, he was on that day my friend. He swore to separate sanctity from sin, that my healing could yet be harnessed without harm. Sure, but who's harnessing it? I'm with Rocket. Raker knew exactly what he was doing. That man's a master manipulator. Damn it! Now you've got me doing it. I bear no blame for my fallen friend. Our errant experiment all but broke us both. Then how do you explain how your best bud got his hands on the stone and has now taken over the galaxy? I cannot. I think... I can answer that. After I rejected my promise, I got pulled in the Nikki's. Corral was there. She was trying to show me something. Peter, you can't trust anything you saw in there. This was different, and it felt different. She took me back to the QZ and I saw that Magus thing. I saw it get all twisted up with Nikki and I... I saw it kill Corel. You hear yourself? How'd she show you this if she's dead? Quite conceivably. Her soul may be snared by the stone, chained to the child. get her back. Essence can be retained, but not restored. Her echo acts as anchor, manipulated by Magus to deceive the daughter. So, it's like Corel said. Nikki needs to accept her death. This feat is not so easily done. Its appetite is insatiable. If unassailed, Magus will absorb all. We're gonna need one hell of a plan. Well, you better come up with it quick, because I see daylight. The bond between Magus and Matriarch must be broken. It harvests its hunger through the host. So... Nikki's like the head vampire. If we cure her, it'll free the rest. Why didn't you just say that? 